Hello everyone, my name is John. Today I will tell you how to set up the upload of new orders from Equid to Simla. This is necessary to automatically transfer new orders from Equid to other systems. For example, in Simla, create new orders each time a new order is added to Equid. It is convenient to store, process and interact with them in every possible way in the future. Now let's move on to the setup. First you need to create a new connection. Select Equid as the data source system. Next, you need to choose an action, Get Orders New. Next, you need to connect your Equid account to the Apex Drive system. In this window, we need to specify the login and password of the Equid personal account. When the connected account is displayed in the list, select it and click Continue. There are no additional settings for the Equid system, so just click Continue. At this stage, you can set up a data filter, in this case there is no need for this, so we also click Continue. At this point, you see test data for one of your Equid orders. If everything suits you, click Next. This completes the setup of the Equid data source successfully. Now you need to move on to setting up data reception. Choose Simla as the data receiving system. Next, you need to select an action, create order. At this stage, you need to connect your Simla account to the Apex Drive service. In this window, you must specify the API domain and API key. In order to get them, go to the Simla system. Copy domain from address bar. Please note that you need to copy domain without extra characters. Next, paste it into the required field in the Apex Drive service. Now you need to specify the API key, we return to the Simla system. Go to the Settings, Section Integration to the tab API Access Keys. Next, click Add. In the Access Type field, select the desired store for which the API key will be generated. Please note that for each store in Simla, you will need to set up a separate integration, as each store must have its own API key. For convenience, we can write comment. Also, make sure all checkboxes are enabled in the Allowed Actions in API section. Then click Save. Copy the API key and paste it into the appropriate field in the Apex Drive system. When all the required fields are filled, click Continue. When the connected account is displayed in the list, select it and click Continue. At this stage, first you need to specify the parameters of your order. Next, you need to fill in the fields with variables from Equid. To assign a variable, click on the field and select the required variable from the drop-down list. Please note that you can not only add variables, but also prescribe values manually.
When all the necessary data is assigned, click Continue. At this stage, we see the test data that will be sent to Simla. In order to check the correctness of the settings, click Send Test Data to Simla. Go to your personal account and check the result. If everything suits you, we return to the Apex Drive service and continue the configuration. On this, the data reception setup has been successfully completed, now you need to enable auto-update. Select the communication interval, for example, once every 5 minutes. That's all, I wish you successful integration settings and good luck.